Hi, today we are going to perform correlation analysis in R Studio. And in order to carry out the correlation analysis, uh, I'll be using a data set which is already available on my desktop. And for that, I have to import that data set. Uh, and for importing the data set, what I have to do, I will click on this option here import data set. I'll click on this and I have to choose in which format my data set is since my data set is stored in Excel form I will click on this then what I have to do I have to click on this option browse and find out where my data set is since my data set is on desktop and the name of my data set is pine I'll click on this pine and then click on this open then within fraction of seconds it will get displayed here it is then I have to click on this import and data set is imported here so in order to see what how many number of observations are in my data set I will simply write dim followed by the name of my data set so there are 300 rows and two columns since I have only two columns one is height and diameter so I am interested to carry out the correlation analysis among these two variables for that I'll be utilizing a library which is known as Matan. it is a very famous library for multi and environmental trials and you can see here you can put it, it can perform a lot of analysis especially in context to plant breeding and people who are doing breeding trials or doing tree implement work so I will write Maton then in order to carry out the correlation between these two variables I will simply write a default function so this is the default function for carrying out the correlation between the variables and that is cor underscore cof it calculates the correlation coefficient between the variables then I have to write the name of the data set within these brackets I will press on the enter and the results are displayed here so here the correlation coefficient between height and diameter is 0 0.94 it's a very strong amount of correlation and it is evident from the p-values it is a significant correlation so apart from performing the correlation analysis I'm I'm also interested to carry out the regression analysis between height and diameter where I will uh, choose height as a dependent or a target variable or a study variable and diameter as independent variable in order to perform a regression analysis or fit a regression equation in R studio we have to use a default function that is known as LM this is for linear models followed by these brackets and within these brackets we have to set a formula for a dependent and an independent variable so we have to set an equation uh, like y versus x so since my y variable is height I will write height versus diameter so diameter is my independent variable comma then the name of the data set which is pine so this is the function and I want to uh, write a name for this function suppose I will write fit followed by this is equal sign or you can use this sign also there is no problem in this this is actually an assignment operator and it is actually is equal to then I will click on the enter then I will write summary then again I will write this fit and the results of the fitted regression equations will be displayed and you can see we have set an equation the formula is height versus diameter height is my dependent and this is my independent variable the name of my data set is pine and these are the summary statistics of the residuals which are very important as per regression is concerned and we have the results for this coefficient for intercept is 2.63 and our value of regression coefficient is 0 0.61 both of them are significant and you can find out the residual standard error 3.441 on 298 degrees of freedom since in case of regression equation the error degrees of freedom are always number of observations minus the number of parameters since the parameter here are two the total number of observations are 300 that is 300 minus 2 is equal to 298 and we have a good value of multiple r square that is coefficient of determination and you all know that its range is from 0 to 1 or 0 to 100 percent 
and since the value is 0 0.90 that means 90 percent of the variation in height is explained by the diameter alone and only 10 percent remains in the error and by means of 0 0.61 the value of the regression coefficient it says us if we change the diameter by one centimeter the height will get increased by 0 0.16 meters so this is a very basic analysis you can perform uh, on your data set if you are interested to carry out the correlation and the basic regression in R studio hope this video will be beneficial for all the beginners thank you